Hello guys, so welcome to a brand new video of Kerbal Space Program with me, Wall 377 uh, Today, I'm going to design something I haven't done before. Um, a UFO. I don't know what I'm going to be doing, <clears throat> so bear with me. So we're going to start off with a flat disk. It's going to be unmanned to begin with. Um, we're going to have that and a reaction wheel, maybe something a bit bigger. That's fine, actually. And what I need I need a bigger version of that, if we've got one. There we go. Plonk. So that's going to be like our center. And now I want wings that are going to give it lift. RCS tank. Only a small one. And lots of thruster blocks. Uh, and that way we can give it the momentum it needs to go round and round and round. Put some more here. Symmetrical, so it looks cool. Um, and I might even. Oh, that's very cool. Let's do that. Oops. Uh, here we go. Like this. <laughs> so badass. <laughs> okay. the wrong way. What I'll do is I'll put something at the bottom of it that it can sit on, just to begin with, and we'll see how that fares on the launch pad. Let's see this thing in action. Um, right, so <laughs> it does spin. I'm just going to hammer it. Uh, that might be SAS stopping it from going around. Is that literally it? Okay, so my UFO isn't isn't flying yet. Um, that's really lame, isn't it? Uh, and we'll put in a large flat baby there. These are wicked. If I can get a load of these on here, I'll burn it off by accident. Is it that one? Wow, okay. And then I put a load of thrusters around. Um, I think it's that way around. Probably the other way around, is she? So it goes this way around. Uh, this way around. Let's have a go. Okay, here we go. Uh, so you want to go that way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Put SAS on and the RCS on. And we just need to throttle up, right? And press spacebar in three, two, one. Okay, let's get this whirly bird off the ground. Um, enabling everything, and three, two, one. It's not going anywhere. It's pretty impressive, though, I've got to say. We just need more lift. Something like that, maybe. Okay, in three, two, one. Okay, let's try this one. Throw up and go. Wee! 
Helicopter launch in three, two, one, go. Well, that didn't go quite as planned, but well, at least the blade stayed on. Yes, difficult one, he thinks. Um, yeah, I wonder if we can add some more of these. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe this is the problem. Okay, this thing's gotta... If I go back to my original design, this thing's gotta take off. I mean, that's insane amount of uh, wingage. He's got today. Um, so I think that's the right way around. Let's double check that. So they're gonna, yeah, that's correct. So we've got three of them there and three of them there. Save. Do you know what we could use? We could use some struts maybe. Because these wings uh, are possibly going to fall off now. Darn it. Here we go. Beautiful. Um, and what we'll need as well just in case, just to keep those struts going, is um, a solar panel. Um, yeah, whatever, that's fine. Just to keep that going. Okay, here we go. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, wow! That's working brilliantly! Woohoo! Oh yeah! Can I control it? Whoa, we've run out of fuel. Uh, oh. <laughs> uh oh. That's look how graceful it's falling. 2.9 meters per second falling. It's probably going to la land without like damaging itself. Like, you know how some of those trees fall in the wind and they go round in circles? You know, you used to call them helicopter, didn't you? And you kind of threw them up and they kind of spiral down. They've only got one wing. But, like, those little seeds, this, this is like that, just kind of falling gracefully. Is it going to actually land? If it actually lands, then this is an excellent design. I didn't touch that. That is wicked. <laughs> So how how far I, how, what can I do with this thing? Okay, let's scale this up. Okay, so let's throttle this baby up. Uh, not all the way. Let's start off small, and we can slowly throttle her up. Okay. Oh, 
it's falling. Whoa, I can't even see what's going on. I ran out of fuel! Did it run out of fuel? Nah, no, okay, it's not feeding from the inner tank. I'll have to put some pipes there. Okay, so at this stage what I might need is some sort of st stabilizers for this bottom section so it doesn't go... Um, like last time it went a bit skew didn't it? So what I'm going to do is um, try and try and make it a bit more stable by adding... Uh, well, stabilizers, just like a bike maybe. Uh, it's difficult to see. Just something simple, uh, maybe a bit bigger. I need that's too big. That's not too bad. Let's put them there. See if we can lower this a little bit. Okay, and further to that, what we can also add are some more struts to each of these arms pointing inwards. give it that stability. Okay, that looks like a pretty um, solid design. Let's save and launch. Okay, so throttle up and fire. Here we go, everything's working as intended. Now I'm really going to throttle up to the top. Watch this fuel reserves though, because as these get lower and lower and lower, we'll get lighter. We've got lift off. I think. Yes, we've got lift off. So let's slow ourselves down. Now we know we've got lift off. Because I don't know how much rotation we're actually adding. I don't think it's that much. I mean, that's pretty cool, right? It's just to uh... see so that's not adding a lot of rotation oh it falls a lot faster with that uh... oh look it's slowing down slowing down ah! it falls a lot faster um, with all that extra weight on I'm not sure if this is the best way to get that rotational um, so, you know that rotation we're looking for so maybe there's another way of, of we can do it another way. Uh, revert flight. So uh, what I could do is increase the increase the amount of turning force by moving things away from uh, the center. So if I move the thrust away from the center, the turning force will increase. Uh, like that, for instance. Uh, maybe just three and then I can do it again here and then again below that um, there maybe Oops, that didn't work okay what's going on here I hate this cling there we go there and one more here that's looking good now maybe if we get the original propulsion pods that we had this these ones um, now I think uh, it will take fuel from the inside, given that these are just um, like metal bars. I think they're fuel cross feed capable. Yeah, they are. So that should work brilliantly. Uh, cool. And one more here. All right. Now that should be a force to be reckoned with. In my opinion, let's have a let's have a little look at this this baby. And indeed, what we might find here is that there's just too much, um, there's just not enough lift. So we could I increase the uh, the angle of some of these blades. I mean, it's very stable at the moment, but um, there's just too much fuel here, maybe. So we'll think about getting rid of that. Okay, so we're lifting off straight away with this design. Whether we only need a couple of them, or whether we do need all of them. So 
So we're going to run out of fuel again soon. Uh, still not sure. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, straight off the ground, no delaying, so I was right. So these sh this should last twice as long. We should get twice as high up. Approaching the 130 mark. I'm going to turn on SAS just to keep it. No, actually, that might reduce our turning speed. So I think we're okay. I mean, it's pretty stable. Magical. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where do I center this thing? Whoa. I don't think I can. God, I'm just making it worse. It's so difficult to steer because obviously you don't, you can't. Oh my God, we're going into a spin. Uh, that's not ideal. Can I correct? Can I correct? Eek! Uh, can I correct? Can I correct? Can I correct? Can I correct? Yes, maybe, 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 maybe. Or is it doing itself? It's probably doing itself, but it makes me feel better. Pressing the direction keys. Oh, my wings are gone. No. Well, the wings are wow strong. I think the wings are giving it a lot of stability. So I wonder if we can uh, maybe maybe build on that idea. What do you think? <laughs> That's a monster. Whoa, it doesn't like that at all. Whoa. That is cool. I can't believe that's actually working. I mean, it's obviously going to crash and up all the flames very shortly, but for, for this bit, it's, look at that. Slice the ground. Ah. Not still going. <laughs> this thing is crazy. I love it. Oh, that's the end of that then. Oh, it's still going, look. Okay, here we go. Throttle up. Whoa, whoa, that's fast! Whoa, that's fast! The total, look, 10 meters per second straight up. easily our record. Whoa, 500 meters. Okay, that's it now. We're flying down, aren't we? Oh no, we're going up again. Whoa, whoa, this thing is awesome. Whoa, look at that, 600 meters. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can it self right? No. No chance. Okay, let's crank this baby up. So throttling up and boom. Let's really put some throttle on here. See how high we can get, how quickly. Because it's just a matter of time, it seems, until we spiral out of control. But if we go quickly, it seems like it's more stable. 
so some sort of gyroscopic effect maybe, I don't know, but uh, it seems like it's a possible outcome. Seems like we can't get higher than uh, we did earlier. Just tend to uh, spin out. Look at that. Oh. Okay, here we go, let's throttle this baby up and start. Here we go, so lift off, increasing to maximum velocity. Now that is pretty good. We are ascending a steady 16.9 meters per second. 17. 17.5, I think we've just hit our record, 600 meters. Seven hundred meters. I've got one more idea and then I'm gonna call it a day. And all I'm gonna do is get rid of some excess weight here, so um what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a small, um, but perfectly formed, uh, stack the coupler there, chuck that baby in there, bring it down, how are we looking? Lovely, save. Uh, I'm actually going to save this as uh, my helicopter craft, because it's that good, I want to save it. Heli, heli, save, launch. Here we go. Um, so let me just change around. I almost launched then without doing that. Okay, and decouple node and maximum thrust. So you can see that extra weight loss um, has added an extra meters per second onto our ascent. Starting to get the spinning in now. I'd like to reach 700. I don't know how likely that is. With this. Whoa, 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 whoa. 700? If I get to 1000, that's not going to happen, but if I do. 800? Come on! Oh, look, we're not going to make it! Oh, we're out of fuel. Now we descend. What happened to the nice graceful fall to earth that we experienced later, earlier even? And bang. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed me messing about with helicopters. I think uh, it started off as a UFO project, but yeah, maybe next time I'll concentrate a little bit harder and um, try something that actually works. <laughs> So uh, yeah, if you enjoyed, um, let me know, like the video and all the rest of it, and I'll make some more. So bye for now.